Hi everyone, I'm Mary, and today we're going to be looking at more of Devil Artemis' Cell vs. series, specifically Cell vs. Uganda Knuckles in Hell. We're going to do a bunch of other videos, but Uganda Knuckles, man, I just... I absolutely love every goddamn thing to do with Uganda Knuckles and Cell. These are some of my favorite videos. I don't mean just favorite things Devil Artemis has done. I mean favorite videos on YouTube. And there are some amazing things, including the Mr. Beast videos that are just coming out and all the other crazy shit out there. Out of all of that, I just love the You Got a Knuckle videos because they're stupid and funny and I laugh no matter how many times I see them. So yes, we're doing You Got a Knuckles in Hell today and uh, again, a bunch of videos after that because I'm just going to enjoy the hell out of this and I want to see more. Because I can, and that's amazing. We're going to jump right in. You guys know the deal. Link below, original video. It's Devil Artemis. You know he's batshit insane, funny, talented, and also, have I mentioned batshit insane? Because, dear God, how you can come up with some of these lines? Oh, man. I'm looking at you, notorious Kermit. Yep. Again, links below. Hit him up. And let's get started. Okay. Good old-fashioned brimstone, fire, usual stuff. God damn it! I can't believe I lost to that little shithead. Where the hell am I? Which one was this? I lost to a lot of- What? Uh... Who's there? Show yourself! Ebola! <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Wrong place! The opposite, actually, <laughs> Welcome to the birthplace of Ebola. What? What? This doesn't look like Namek. <laughs> to hell, my- <laughs> This doesn't look like Namek. I just said that he... <laughs> The casual racism against the freaking Namekians. <laughs> Is he just upset because he's all green from them? I'm just going to say that. Hey Buddha, welcome to hell. In hell? I'm in fucking hell? Me? Oh, come on. I wasn't that bad. You did not know the way, my Buddha. So it is your destiny to suffer here for eternity with dead. Can you imagine if Cell was in hell and there was a video series on it? And Devil Artemis was editing it? And for the five people out there who don't get that either, yes, I'm aware Devil Artemis is the one editing Team Four Star's Cell in Hell series. And for the other five people who aren't aware that, yes, Devil Artemis is editing Team Four Star's Cell in Hell series. I know, crazy where they got this idea. It means and those who were pure evil. Well, it can't be that bad. Behold, my Buddha, what? the official theme song of hell. What? Hell has a theme song? Well, hopefully it's catchy. Wait. Wait, wait. Is it what no, I think no, it is? No, 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 please stop. No, no, please, God, no. I take it back. I take it back, please. I'll be a good. No, what is it? No, 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 please. No, God. Oh, God, it's a fucking remix. No, no. What is that? I don't even know. And he blows himself up. No, no, that's just fire. I... Do not know what that song is. And next up, we have Perfect Cell vs. Toy Story. And for some reason, Mr. Potato Head is wanted for... I'm going to hope it says violation, not prostitution. I guess he just uh, kept plugging parts into the wrong section. I'm not even going to touch that one. I... This is... Cell, specifically Devil Artemis' Cell... Toy Story. You know what? No, I was going to say Shaggy made less sense, but Shaggy's so much of a meme, I can kind of see that now. Toy Story. And in, they're doing it out of Andy's room. Oh, God, I said a toy of Cell. <laughs> I hope so. I just make Cell full on toy. Just have fun with how stupid that is. I love this. Also, why does he look so done with it? Probably because of the skit we're about to watch. <laughs> oh, God. Greetings. I'm Buzz Lightyear, and this is Woody. Good voice for him. Howdy. We'd like to welcome you to Andy's Toy Room. I like the Andy's background music toy matching. Room. Toys? Yes. I'm a fucking toy? Yes, you are. I believe at first, but yes, you're a toy. In this world, we're made to be played by children. Hell, even Andy's mom has a toy, and she's an adult. Wait, what? Behold. Son of a bitch! You got me! 
Okay, after that last video, I don't know what we're going with because Toy Story, the toys come alive. Andy's mom's toy is alive. Yeah, it's a good thing. We all know that was just a sword like Cell is holding now. And for YouTube's sake, I only believe it is a sword. I shouldn't be surprised what Devil Artemis, Devil Artemis is all over the place. But I was, and he did, and um, I need to show that to my wife. <laughs> Next up, we have Perfect Silver's Dark Side Kermit, and oh wait, they're really, he's reusing the hellscape to do a fight between Cell and Kermit, and Wait, if they're on a fire, I'm guessing because of the background looks similar. Does that make Cell Obi-Wan? Oh, this I have to see. Kermit's Dragon Ball GT is evil. From yes. my point of view, Dragon Ball Super's evil. Stop being a bitch, Kermit. I mean, fuck you, suck my dick, Cell. It's over, Kermit. <laughs> Even I one? have the high ground. He's bringing another one. Frog jump. Don't try it. Frog jump. <laughs> ah, shoot. No. Oh. Oh, shit. Wow, he can't jump. I guess I can't jump that high after all. <laughs> Dead. Oh, oh, I can't feel my dick. You're a Fuck. Muppet, Kermit. Ah, oh, my Muppet balls. I can't feel my <laughs> Muppet balls. <laughs> Not anymore. They're on you fire. The chosen one. <laughs> it said you would destroy dragon. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just the fact that you're a Muppet, Kermit. When he says, I can't feel my dick. You're a Muppet, Kermit. I just... <laughs> It's like they're doing the entire bit from Revenge of the Sith, but he just breaks character to say, you're a Muppet Kermit, in such a deadpan, done with that voice. I just, that's... <laughs> oh, God, it's things like that. Just the little unexpected lines that make this so freaking Impulse amazing. GT, not buy the entire series on fucking Blu-ray! You were my brother, Kermit. I loved you. Blu-ray? I, you. I didn't even know they made ah! versions in Blu-ray. Oh, God! All right, next up we have Cell vs. Deadpool Part 2. I'm not sure if this is part two of the therapy session with Deadpool earlier or a video that I just can't seem to find because this entire playlist is kind of... It's a thing. It has videos and there's so goddamn many that if it's missing some... How many are there actually if this is just some of them, not all of them? Oh god, I, I, I'm not going to think about that. So we're just going to see how bad this gets and it's Deadpool and... You know what? Normally I'd say we couldn't have done anything worse than Deadpool. He'll be all over the place, but Toy Story, man. Yeah, that happened. I'm still stuck on that. You know, considering what happened in that one, I probably should not use that phrasing. Let's just move on. So what? I was in line. Little shit cut in front of me. So trust me, I know what? how it feels to lose to a kid. The only difference is I kind of grabbed this him Puerto from Rican Deadpool? his neck, got over my bloodlust. But you know what? I don't think any different of you because in a way, you kind of remind me of myself. Tall, ugly, no friends, full of sexual frustration. Trust me, there's nothing wrong with a little pent-up aggression, am I right? I mean... <laughs> <laughs> I love this one. Yeah, Deadpool. Just talking, 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 and everyone else wanting to murder him. Plus, Deadpool, so it may or may not stick. Probably won't. But more importantly, everything he just said is so horrible because he's comparing them. And he's not even meaning it as an insult, which makes it more insulting that these aren't him trying to be a dick. These are his honest thoughts. It hurts so much more, and I love it. I mean, hey, when I'm all alone, all I need is a little baby oil, and I... <coughs> Dead. Thank you, God. Nope. See, that's the other thing. Guys always think they can just shoot that <laughs> Call me hate you, so. blow him up, chop his head off, cut his nuts off. It doesn't work that way, baby. All of the shit grows back. Now, where was I? Oh, yeah. So you grab the baby. I almost feel right? sorry you for Sal. He definitely lost this one. Massaging it, and then right afterwards. Okay, so originally I was going to say Cell vs. Patrick Part 2. I don't even know where the Part 1 is because apparently it's just not in the list or it's out of order so badly I'm not even going to look for it. But let's just go back to the fact that it's... So, in the Krusty Krab with the hat, which, oddly enough, really does fit on his head, Broly is Spongebob. And I'm going to pretend I didn't just get he actually makes a good Spongebob because he's an idiot and he's golden. That I, I, I'm just going to wipe the fact that that's actually a very good comparison. 
or that Cell, as he's been described in Devil Artemis, basically is Squidward, who's just done with this sh Why is this making sense? Stop making sense! No, we're, we're just moving on. We're moving on. We're just- Welcome no. Welcome to the Krusty Krab. Can I take your order? Hmm. Uh, yeah. Let me get a- uh... oh, I forgot about these characters. Uh... Lobster the Bubble? Wow. Hmm. They're uh... doing the meme with Patrick. Uh, Not- uh, what are they Hey, there's Doodle! Again? Krabby Patties. What's yes. up with the neck? Probably yes, a processing what? thing. Krabby Patties. How many? Didn't How they actually do this in Spongebob too? Krabby Patties. Yes. Yes. I will fucking kill you! <laughs> <laughs> I'm in you! Shut the fuck up, Doodlebug! <laughs> <sighs> Sir, is this all you that. want? No, this is Patrick. <laughs> I fucking hate my- <laughs> <laughs> And as you can see, the entire point for this video was just for the reason to have Cell react to Patrick going, No, this is Patrick. The meme where he has the cell phone, he's just like, No, this is Patrick! <laughs> I just, it's just so stupid. You can tell this is the entire point of it, and he's done with this shit. So, why he actually fits really well in is a stand-in for Squidward. I just, it's perfect. My job. I fucking hate my job. Yes. Rev up them fryers, cause I'm in the mood for a- Boom. And next up, we have Perfect Cell versus Saiyan Elite Kermit. All I gotta say is, oh dear god, we're doing another Kermit episode. Every time he is in- anything to do with Cell. I usually find myself going, what the fuck? Laughing my ass off, but then repeating, what the fuck? And then choking halfway through. It, it's very unpleasant to choke when you're laughing because you really don't want to stop laughing because it's fun, but at the same time, also choking. Some people are into that. I am not. So yeah, we're going to get into this. I'm not sure if this is the first time Cell and Kermit interacted because there's so many and I know the play this is out of order. I'm not even going to try and find the first one, but if anyone knows if this is or something else is, let me know because I'm really curious. Also, really, the, the Saiyan scatter? Oh, God. You fool! <laughs> you can't possibly stand a chance. I'm a froggy elite. Well, with a enough frogs, elite. even someone like me can surpass an elite. It's useless. I'm going to destroy the planet. Really? You have Cell quoting... Oh, God. <laughs> uh, pretty sure this is a quote from Vegeta versus... Purple Guy. Weird thing is, I used to know his name, and I completely am just... Bleh on it. Gooey? Gaiu? Ah, whatever his name is. I can't remember it. The guy who's like all big and bragging, and then Vegeta just humble brags. Well, even with a little training. Unless I'm completely mistaken, this is actually against the Ginyu Force. Oh, well. It's been a long time since I've seen DBZ. I guess I need to go back and fix that. <laughs> hey, the good thing about bad memory. You can rewatch things I enjoy and just get all the fun over again. If, Wait, if I remember. You're trying to destroy the planet? Yes. Well, yeah. Oh my god, so am I! Did we? Did we just become best friends? Did they just go stepbrothers? They just went stepbrothers on this. What the fuck just happened? Oh god, Kermit! What the- why is he- They switched off enemies. Kermit would normally take out Elmo, but now it's so choking Kermit, out Elmo. would you like to do the honors? What is- now, I would love to. My god! My god, it's beautiful! What the fuck? So that's the thing that just happened. It went from quoting early Dragon Ball Z to stepbrothers murdering each other's enemies and blowing up a planet with Kermit. I guess this is where the entire Kermit cell friendship started, which became a running thing. Sure. Let's let's roll with this one. They bonded over wanting to destroy Earth. It's also a cute friendship. It's like, do we want to do the honors, Kermit? And, and then it's like, yeah, sure I would. They get the voice. I just... Devil Artemis has the perfect voice for Kermit to sound like Kermit. Why is it so well voiced? Cell sounds perfect to Cell. Kermit sounds perfect to Kermit. The stop where they're switching off enemies. Kermit stabbing Gohan? What? I just... Sure. Yeah. 
Let's roll with this one. I, I did not expect it to do that. I expected some kind of stupid fight. I didn't expect them to go stepbrothers on it and literally quote stepbrothers. But they did, and that's the thing that happened. <laughs> oh, God. I just... <laughs> what the actual hell am I watching? Devil Artemis does a great job at making some really weird things. And then there, there, there was the Toy Story short. Yep. <laughs> Toys are alive. Not going to think about that one too hard. You know, not not the right word to use. Oh, oh no. Mm. <sighs> I'm just going to stop while I'm behind. <laughs> you guys know the deal. Links below original videos. Hit them up. It's Devil Artemis. Don't watch them in public. <laughs> Do not watch them out loud in public. Oh, God. Unless you're that guy and you're trying to assert dominance by... Making everyone else stare at you going like, oh my god, what is wrong? In which case, good on you. Good luck. All the same. I'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.